सो हेलो एवरी वन आई एम श्रेष्ठ आई एम ए सॉफ्टवेयर डेवलपमेंट इंजीनियर सो वी आर स्टार्टिंग विद दिस लीड कोड प्रीमियम टॉप इंटरव्यू प्रॉब्लम सीरीज वी विल बी डिस्कसिंग ईच एंड एवरी प्रॉब्लम विच आर मैंशन ऑन द लीड कोड टॉप इंटरव्यूज एंड ऑल्सो दिस विल हेल्प यू टू क्रैक योर नेक्स्ट कोडिंग इंटरव्यू इन द टॉप नॉच प्रोडक्ट बेस्ड कंपनी सो लेट स्टार्ट विद द प्रॉब्लम in this section uh, we will look at this problem uh, the longest common prefix uh, it's a very common interview problem uh, so basically what it says that we have been given a list of integers uh, sorry a list of strings and we need to find the longest common prefix in that so let's look at what the problem is saying so the problem statement is very simple so it says that we have been given a string strs which include certain uh, let's say like flight uh, like flower and flow this is the string and the output that we are getting is fl okay so uh, one technique to solve this if we'll sort this array we'll all get the all the letters in a sorted fashion means in the ascending order so after that if we use two pointers i and j that point towards the first and the last element present okay first and the last string and then we try to compare if the we'll get let's say this value is this string is a this is b if we are getting a is equal to is equal to a of b of i then we are good to go we'll add this in our answer okay and if it's not the case we'll just break out of the loop and look for the second okay so this way we can solve this question it's fairly easy it belongs to the easy to medium category but it is very intuitive it uses the sorting in a uh, very defined manner so let's try to code this one uh, so as we discussed uh, we'll first have uh, we'll first have let's first calculate the size so int n is equal to uh, strs dot size so this will give us the size of the uh, list okay uh, now let's uh, use the let's evaluate the binary condition uh, sorry the boundary condition so this will be null if it is zero and uh, let's now declare two strings first let's sort it and then we'll so we'll sort uh, begin strs and uh, end strs okay uh, now we will get two strings strs we'll try to compare those two this is the first and this is the last strs n minus 1 okay then we'll iterate over the int i is equal to 0 int i less than i less than a dot size and then we'll do just i plus plus now for each string we'll just check that if a of i is equal to b of i Uh, and also for our answer we'll define another string int ans is equal to uh, we'll just do a answer plus equal to a of i else we'll break out of the loop uh, and we'll find it return as so what we are doing as we discussed we'll first sort the string and use two pointers a uh, type of thing over these strings and we'll uh, try to traverse the whole string and look for uh, whether we are having the characters in common or not so if we are having the characters in common we'll just add them to our answer else we'll break out of the loop so this was it uh, so the overall uh, time and space complexity time complexity will be uh, log n log n because we are traversing also we are sorting and the space will be constant so thank you uh, first let's run this one first uh, so this is end. okay 
yeah so it got accepted and uh, okay so i already discussed the time and the space complexity uh, so we'll meet you in the next session thank you